Another Telstar update video for you all. I keep meaning to do this, but it always slips them on. Anyway, recently got a S14 radiator, which is absolutely gigantic. It's a 72 mil tank and a 52 or 50 mil core, dual core, and it is huge. And because it's not a Telstar direct fit, I had to make my own mounts, etc. So just waiting for the paint to dry, and I'll give you an update in five or ten when the next coat's dry. Now, so a little update: I've got the new mounts and everything for the ones down the bottom, hooked up all the hoses, added the uh, hose down the bottom, connect, like cut it up and everything, make it fit. Um, still making mounts for this. I've finished this one here. And I'm still just waiting for the paint to dry on this one here. Thought I'd mention another little problem that I had was down here on the stock radiator. There's a little cutaway or a little slope for where the hose would go for the radiator. But on the S14 one, which is this radiator's out of originally, um, it's further over, like to the corner of the radiator. So I've had to move the whole thing right over to the right, and you can see it's very, very tight in here. Anyway, that's the new mount that I've made up. Just a quick welding job and cleaned it up, painted it and so on. Last a bit of bling in here. I've still got to paint this other one down here, but aside from that, let's fill her up and yeah, it'll probably take another two more, three more litres than it does stock.